Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play A Link To The Past. Last episode we got some art pieces and we ended up grabbing the ice rod. Anyway, uh, so I made my way back to Kakarika Village off screen just because there's an item we have to get here. And every time I come down here I always fail to get this item. I keep ma feel mentioning it inside the back of the bar. Open up this bottom uh, area. We get another bottle. It's so minute. I always forget about it. But I figure I might as well grab it now. So, there's the bottle is. Alright. It's to the bottom left of the house that's overgrown grass. Where the guy tells you, oh, thanks for uh, coming by. I never get visitors. You know, that guy. So, now we get that. We can make our way... Uh, let's see, where should we go? We can visit the witch's hut. Let's do that. Bring the, the mushroom to the witch's hut. Why not? So, the witch's hut is just directly to the right. And while we make our way there, I'll explain that, uh... You get magic powder from the magic uh, mushroom there that we picked up in the Lost Woods. Uh, it's not really that important early on, but uh, come about halfway through the game or so, it'll become more useful. Uh, soon enough, viewers. Soon enough. We will get a pretty useful thing from it. So, anyway, we gotta equip the mushroom hit Y and she talks to you about uh, I'll come back to the shop later for something good so we'll do that later but first while we're in the shop let's buy something she tells you you know red's a medicine life red heals your heart uh, green gives you magic and blue does both she gave me a sample of the red potion how nice of her all right I'm gonna buy a blue potion just because you know, it can't be too safe. So, we can't do anything over here yet. The waterfall wishing is just ahead. We'll go there soon enough. Yeah, uh, soon enough we'll go there. Then we could wish on the wish for something. So, now that we did all those side quests, this episode we're gonna try to. See if we can find the next dungeon. Go to the desert. We gotta go down through the area here, back to where we ended the last episode. And we can make our way over here. Let's see if we can. Let's make our way there now. So, oh, went down too far. <laughs> anyway, how you guys been doing? Been doing good, I hope. Anyway, let's keep going. Yeah. Okay, I was just thinking out loud here. Oh, to myself, I should say. Do you guys think I should play uh, other games like Mario? You know, like different Mario games and stuff like that, as well as doing Let's Plays. Like, I love all these games, but I was thinking about playing like, every few days, upload a third, you know, just a RAM game or so every now and then. Every few days or whatnot, like a. Th Ooh, what's this? Let's go in and find out. And not get hit by a cactus like I did. Anyway, when we walk up the stairs, we'll notice there's another door. Oh, look, it's an old man. Ah, you can read the language of Hylia people. He is actually one of the old wise men who sealed away Ganon, this guy. He's hiding himself here in hiding. And uh, I came down here so I could blow up this wall and we'll find a unique, well not unique, kind of, but we'll find an item in here. It is a piece of heart. Alright. We got six hearts. So, 
I hope you're not impatient. Uh, I hope if you're impatient, I hope I didn't uh, take too long to go to the next temple. But here it is. Oh, there's a heart. I wonder how we get this. We'll find out. Alright, to open the way to go forward, wish you granted. Link's gonna pray. Alright. So, since Link prayed, the moving statues are gonna move. While wow, the bird still circles us, of course. Alright, let's see if we can destroy this bird. There we go. Now that we opened up the pathway, let's head on in. The next dungeon. Number two, dungeon. The, all right, these guys here, they're gonna shoot at you if you're in the, within the same eye view. So you don't wanna be. Uh, I'm gonna go to the right first. Got them. Let's go over here. These guys, we just gotta destroy them because they'll shoot things at you. Those guys go into the ground, they'll peer back up wherever. But. Yeah, it's not much to this dungeon, just simple stuff. Hey, come on, buddy. Knock him out. Ooh, and we found treasure. Alright, we got the map. So I noticed that uh, when you pick up pots and you throw at the enemies, they die quicker. Sometimes when they're attacking them, this is the map area. So, let's just keep going to the right a little bit more. Alright. Oh, what's that name? Oh, what's that noise? What could that noise be? I wonder. Well, sounds like it's coming from the room next to us. Dodge this guy and just keep attacking him. One more attack and he should be dead. Well, three in one attack. Nice. Alright, well. Let's keep him down. We don't have a key. Yet. We'll get one soon enough. I want to show you down here. We're back outside. But we can't do anything because if we jump off, we're back at the entrance. So, let's ignore this area for now. Oh, he didn't shoot me this time. Ooh. Last time I played through this game, he, uh, you know, they kept hitting me. I learned to easily dodge him, though. Just run around. Anyway, let's just kill this guy. Go up here. Wait, no, not up here. It's back to the other area. No. Alright, smarmy mallard. Get together. <laughs> I'm telling myself to get together. Got the key. Pegasus boosts the wall up. And Sashurala talks to us. You know, if you must never fail to find all the treasures in this dungeon. Oh, of course I get hit by him now. Alright. Alright, let's continue on. Now there's a button we have to press in here. Let's go up here. I just want to show you this is the boss room. We, the uh, boss treasure. We can't do anything with that one if we have the proper key. So if we don't have the proper key, we're kind of screwed right now for that. So let's just continue on. Now we got the key. Otherwise, but we're down there shooting enough viewers. But now we got the key, we gotta go this way. Back to that door to the right, and we will find out what's in it. Dodge these guys straight down here. Hook her right into this door. Knock a few enemies around. Grab this. Alright. 
Yeah, those guys, to my knowledge, I we can't beat them as of yet. So this room, uh, they just keep shooting these ball things at you. So just, you know, try your best to dodge them and run on through. Oh, that was a smooth dodge. I almost got hit. All right. So now that we got the key, let's head back up to that room. Back up here. And this way. And we can end up getting to that treasure chest I showed you. I want to show you treasure chest before I grabbed it, just because I was like, might as well. Now we get some time in this episode. We got the power glove. Now we can pick up some small stones and such. Which means we could visit other areas. Haha, <laughs> got him. With the pot throw. I always do that, I don't know why. Alright. Almost got it. There, got him. Okay. Now that we grab the gloves, let's go down here. Alright, push this block up and we'll run in here. We found some fairies. You'll probably, you'll probably be like, Smarmy Mallard, why did you grab the uh, blue drink if you grab the fairy? Well, the reason for the grabbing the blue drink, viewers, is because the blue potion, it heals your magic as well as your hearts. And if we're ever low on magic and we can't, we need to use it and we can't find a way to get any magic, I decided, might as well. Just in case we need to refill our magic bar, you never know. You know enemies drop magic quite frequently. So anyway, we grab out and we can pick up a rock now. Now we can grab those. We can't really do much right now here yet. We could go exploring out in the world, but let's just finish up this dungeon. We're almost done with it. That's right. Push this one up. And one of these pots has the key. All while he dies in this one. Alright. I said I wanted to grab more hearts because of like anyway, you don't have to wait for all those to pick up and throw at you. Once you get the key you can leave the area. And anyway, now we have to defeat all the enemies in here. Ooh, that was a smooth dodge. All right, let's grab the money they drop and let's head on. They drop a lot of money here. It's kind of nice. Whoa. All right. Please be hurt. No. All right. We're in the boss room. I'm looking for some hearts now. We're near the boss area. Not in the boss room yet, we're near it. I know it's a boss room, but I meant to say boss area. Let's kill this guy. Alright, now we gotta use our lamp. And magically, the wall just grows more. And that's the boss key we need to get in there. The big key, I have to say. Let's see a couple of ice rod. Here's the boss room. These guys come up, these snakes come up on the ground. We just gotta... What I like to do is just spin attack. And what's up for falling debris while you're at it? These guys aren't that difficult, they're just highly annoying. Especially if you're new to the game and you're not really... You know, oh, one down. Almost dead, alright. Where's the next guy coming up? This way, right? 
Can we get him this time? One more hit for that guy, I believe. Alright. I was wrong, it wasn't one more hit. Ha! Huh. Alright, where is he? There he is. He's dead. So, one more guy here. Got him! Alright. And we got the Pendant of Wisdom. Now we got this, we need one more to go into the Floss Woods to get the Master Sword afterwards. You won the Pendant of Power. Interesting. I thought it was Wisdom this entire time. Boy, am I blind. Can't even read half the time. <laughs> oh well. Anyway, now you grab that. Ooh, what's that? I wonder. Well, I don't think we can do anything with that yet. But, let's explore a little bit more. Shall we? This is a fair area. We don't really need to do anything here. But, it's... I don't know how long it's real. It's, we're going on 18 minutes without the editing. So I'm going to end the video here. I will see you guys in the next one. Uh, if you have any game recommendations for me to play, let me know. Next episode, we'll go down here and see what's in this. And we will get the, I guess, Pendant of Wisdom? Apparently, which is usually red is power i don't know anyway let's go let's go and uh end the video here i will see you in the next one goodbye